Hey guys, this is Steve back with another video and today I'm going to show you guys how to install paid apps and games to your iPhone, your iPad and your iPod Touch. Now there are three uh, methods, so this video is going to be the first method or I will do the second and third method very soon. So this uh, video we are going to focus on uh, installing apps, paid apps and games to your iPhone your iPad or your iPod Touch uh, through, through a program on your PC. Uh, the second method will be uh, using an IPA files and a third way is uh, using directly on your iPhone, your iPad or your iPod Touch. So, the, um, so uh, this method is about programs. So what programs should we use? Uh, now actually there are a lot of uh, applications the less you do this so I want to sh uh, show you guys uh, three or four of them today uh, of course you can actually find them on the internet uh, so the first uh, program I really recommend is vShare helper uh, this is a of course this is similar to do your tools which lets you uh, know uh, your and will let you uh, find information about your uh, iPhone iPad or iPod touch devices uh, information, your UDID, uh, your serial number, or some sort of things. But I will focus on the apps. So, as you can see, in here, uh, we can uh, actually uh, look at some of the applications uh, here. Now, um, it when you connect your device, there will be a secret download called VShare Helper. Uh, of course, this will install an app. Uh, this visual helper uh, on your iPhone, iPad, or your iPod Touch, uh, and of course you can actually install app directly from the app on your iPad as well. But um, since, since this method is on is using a program on your PC, I'm not going to show you guys that thing. I will show you guys this app later in the third method. But uh, focus on here. So as you can see, we can actually find a lot of um, free and the paid one or even the unique one. First up is Playbox HD and um, Movie Box. As you can see, these two are basically the one that uh, the best movie playing application. Uh, get the free movies here. Uh, but of course, you cannot download because oh, you can actually download it, uh, which is cool. You can actually download the you can actually download and download the application right here. And then just hook it uh, and wait for it to done. And then once you're done, it will automatically install uh, the application on your iPad. Now, uh, so just wait. And boom. Uh, as you can see that we are done. And let's check by open up this application right here. Okay. So as you can see uh, that I got this application loaded on my iPad. So just click on it, of course it will ask you to trust. Now the, the Playbox HD and Moviebox are the two only apps that when you install it, it will pop this uh, message up. Uh, the others will be okay, I'll uh, just launch and you just fine. But with Playbox HD and uh, Moviebox, since it's not an app store apps, it will require you to trust and do you know what that means that after like seven days or so it will no longer be working so uh, I'll show you guys how to trust it just click on cancel and go to settings and go to set general and scroll down as you see device management tap on it uh, tap on the enterprise the profile and tap on trust and trust so you are done so basically that's how to uh, download app. I want I wanna show you guys some more. So we're uh, just gonna launch up uh, back we should help with you. Of course you can install more. So let me show you guys um, Pocket Minecraft as you can see. You click on download and it will pop up in the download here and you can just wait for download. Uh, sometimes when after downloading you will see it just stuck at zero kilobyte per second 
and then just goes up for a few seconds, then go down to zero. This is my issue. This is no problem. Uh, it's that just that it actually take a little bit more time. So um, if you just like this is a uh, wait patient, yeah, you see that, yeah, just going on download, just fine. And once you hooked up, just done, then you will appear here, click on install, and you should be installed. Now, uh, if now this app has some uh, issue when the first time you install it will fail. Of course, you can actually reinstall the second time; it will work. Uh, we have several times. So this is um, so this is a VShare Helper, really good application, uh, one of the best one. Another app is yeah, Google <laughs> Tools. Yes, um, it's now updated to version two point which lets you also has an app uh, store right here. Uh, but right now they're on not too many apps. So I want to search one of the like the paid, the really good one, but you. Probably just find some of the free ones and uh, yeah, we are going through that some games for example. These these games are not popular at all. Um, some they they, they basically they're all free. So on the app store, so uh, uh, what's one of one of it? But you know, that's it's fair enough. Once that just click on install, you need to find your Apple ID, uh, hook it up an Apple ID on it, and you should be done. So that is video tool, not quite, but yeah, you know. So the next thing is PP25 5.0. Now this is um, a Chinese one, so you might or may not like it, but this is also one of the really cool paid application. So um, of course it will also support us jailbreaking iOS uh, 10.0 to 10.2, but I cannot demonstrate it because my device is on iOS 10.2. One, so um, what did I tell you? about a new update coming up. It's gonna hook it up here. So for skin has to do update because basically, um, you know, your app store cannot update this paid app, this app that you install from to your tools from PP25 or VShare Helper because they simply have a different app ID. So just click on the store, the second option right here, and you should be in. Uh, this home screen and just uh, you might find Chinese app but just know them just find some of the popular uh, the, the, the the paid kind of game sample uh, one right then just uh, click download it um, yeah also click pop and download right here as you can see very nice uh, of course I already got one so just gonna do that um, but I gotta update this thing first, so I gotta leave with that. Uh, another fourth one I haven't installed, but it is called Tongbu Assistant. I actually experienced it before, and it's also a really good. Uh, the same, just you know, find an app, just uh, download it, and wait for it to install, and you should be good. So basic, that's basically the first method of how to install paid apps and games onto your iPhone, your iPad, and your iPod Touch. Uh, if you find this video useful, just hit the likes uh, down below and share and of course comments uh, for problems and I will reply it. Uh, just stay tuned for the second method where I'll show you guys how to do it by the IPA files. Um, it will be a little more complicated, but it, uh, if you succeeded, you should be good to go. Thanks for watching, I'll see you guys next time.